Hi friends, it's Justine. Today, we will be making my bullet journal together. I kept a journal in the first half of 2017, but I stopped because I didn't want to remember a lot of those moments. But I really want to get my life together again because I just hate having all your thoughts scattered in your brain. You know, like, parang, oh, by the way, you have to do this, some errands, and you have to worry about this, and anxiety, and your future, and everything all at the same time. Basta, nakasabi sabay sila sa head go. So, I like putting all of those thoughts in a single notebook. This is a soft cover pocket moleskin. It is also dotted in the color khaki beige. I really like the color and Sobrang smooth niya, sobrang high quality, except I'm not that happy with the one that I got. It seems old. Meron siyang stains in barang stock siya ganun, and I don't really like that part. I got this from Zalora for 800 something plus shipping. Ayan, these are just black pages still, and I'm going to be doing my bullet journal with you guys. I like to keep my bullet journals minimal kasi I don't know how to draw and lettering and stuff. Hindi ako artsy, but I really like having things in one place. Parang madali tignan yun. Malinis lang. For writing, I have this. <laughs> Ignore yung logo dyan. Pero I like keeping my pens here kasi malaki. What I mainly use to journal is... Bato na dito. This GTEC pen in 0.3. I usually go for mas makapal na pen. Yung parang tip. Pero in this case, maliit lang yung journal ko. Which is exactly how I like it to be kasi parang pero gusto madala anywhere it's just great so what I was saying is maliit na yung tip so baka okay mas maganda tignan yung maliliit lang rin yung strokes yung mga sulat ko hindi yung mas makapal na tip I also have a few pencil tapos my highlighter also some ang daming alikabok office ba na hindi ko na hindi ko ginagamit I also have some markers here just in case I have to mark some things a sharpie and also also, these pens that I really like, they are Dong A My Colors. I have it in purple, pink, and yellow. Double ended siya. Dito para siyang marker na mas makapal. Tapos dito, mas precise. I like those. And also, I have some washi tapes here. Actually, they are called paper tapes. When I make mistakes, I don't really like erasing them or correction tape or pupulitin ko yung paper kasi it's a waste of paper. So, I use these. These are paper tapes. Parang I just go over them. I got these from Divisoria. Mura lang to. I also have some stationery parang malilit na notes. I can just cut this up kasi I really like the texture of this and yung feel niya parang rustic. This is a recycled paper from Pape Marotti. I love their stationery. Also have a broken ruler here kasi maliit lang. Mas madali siya i-align dito. I suggest you guys look into them if you're looking for stationery kasi theirs are so cheap environmental friendly and made from the Philippines. Okay, so this is my notebook. Like I said, it is a moleskin soft pocket dotted notebook. And it has a pocket dun sa backside niya which just contains yung packaging and I keep my sticker there. Tapos sa front, obviously meron din yung name, yung contact number in case I lose it. And then yung index, I put it there. Hindi ko pa tapo. So you will see na I will outline it and stuff. And then we have my first actual page. No, yung basta yung 2018. I went for the constellation theme, stars and moon. Tapos here we have my future log. This is the page of my future log na I will do in front of you guys. But ito yung kalabasan niya. So here, ginagawa ko lang yung parang title. I made a little fancy um, tag dito, cursive lettering, pero di ba na ako magaling magsulat so I tried my best and sorry, yung camera medyo shaky kasi masyadong mahangin lately sa Pilipinas <laughs> and yan this kind of spread is useful kasi I can just put yung ano yung importanting dates sa year na I already have planned and then I have my goals, tapos video ideas, and then nilagay ko rin yung keys ko I also have a page which is art consumed, including my films, shows, and music na I like. And then my monthly spread. Tate, I used to go for an actual calendar looking one, pero ngayon, I want a similar one to my yearly spread. Madali lang siya kasi walang 
empty na spaces in case wala akong masyadong plano sa araw na yun. Sorry, kita yung head ko. I'm just going for another constellation themed one. I really, really like this. Kasi nakita ko siya sa Pinterest and ang ganda niya. I just find it really pretty. And then you can see here na I'm trying to do my weekly spread. Um, I actually finish it pero buburahin ko rin kasi I don't really like yung wala akong masyadong space to write on. I like reflecting what happened on that day. So I just inserted a little post-it note which I will be replacing actually. Gusto ko kasi yung sa next page. Kita ko yung actual week. So, magka side by side siya. And I honestly like that one more. I mean, this one. And nagkamali ako. So, I just used a paper tape na I can just write on. And yan, I'm going over my weekly spread. Tapos na! We've done it! This is my bullet journal. Nilalagyan ko ng page numbers so I can write it on my index. Though hindi ko pa alam paano format noon, so hindi ko na muna ginawa. And yeah, my future log, um, monthly spread, um, goals, trackers, and yan. I really, really like this notebook. It's really handy and ang ganda ng pages niya and stuff. So, yeah. That's it guys! I really hope you liked this video and it inspired you to start a journal or not even a bullet journal, kahit mag-plan ka lang ng buhay mo. I hope you guys found something from this and if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and that's it guys! Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!